I'm Chris Brocalo, reporting for the Winnipeg Sun in Winnipeg. Truth and reconciliation. The truth is out there. Canada has taken ownership of a dark chapter of its history. The truth that for years, young Indigenous boys and girls from across Canada were forcibly removed from their families and relocated away from their communities. They're forbidden to speak their native languages, forbidden to study, nurture, participate in, or preserve in any way the culture and traditions from which they had been torn. The truth that horrific abuses frequently took place in schools funded by the Canadian government and administered by the Catholic Church of Canada. The last federally operated residential school closed its doors in 1996. Roughly 150,000 children passed through the schools and more than 4,000 died while attending. The truth is staggering. Reconciliation will be an ongoing process. The truth, in the form of a permanent archive containing all materials related to Canada's residential schools, is located at the University of Manitoba in Winnipeg. It is hoped that the archive will help us all understand this dark part of our shared national history and play a role in the important ongoing journey of reconciliation.